to include uh, the gallery.php file in our index.php, we need to first create a new function called get page name and pass the ID parameter. Now if we copy this content of the previous function, this new one, we modify the SQL statement and we will select PG ID from table pages and what we want is to retrieve the page ID where page identity equals our ID parameter okay in single quotes because it's going to be a string okay all this stays as it is and now if total equals zero then out equals rows pg id and semicolon right at the end and everything else stays as it is so now if we open our index.php file we scroll down to the line with the if statement if get p equals contact us if we remove this whole thing actually and replace it with a switch statement now we're going to use our new function get page name to which we will pass our get p parameter and now we create the first case for the contact us page and let's go and check in our database what id our contact us page has contact us has id of five so if we go back to the editor case five and then break and we will include our inc underscore contact dot php page if we copy this whole case together with the break now let's check the one for the gallery and the gallery is the id of nine if you have any other id just just put the right one so we've got nine here and we replaced the underscore contact with underscore gallery okay we can remove this white space here okay that all seems fine so if we test the page if we go to browser refresh you can see we've got our uh, categories displayed here if we now go back to the editor and open our style sheet general inside of the style folder scroll down and if we create the new id gallery together with images which we will be using for our for this to display actually our images and we define margin of zero zero and the bottom one 14 pixels and then zero from the left as well as padding zero pixels and list style none okay then if we do another one for images li which will be float left with 100 pixels as our thumbnails will have 100 pixels height of 66 pixels as you may remember we've set it up as this in our config.php file then we will have padding of 10 pixels background color we want to be white as well as border to be solid one pixel aaa and margin zero pixels from the top seven from the right seven from the bottom and zero pixels from the left and one last thing is the images img for image and we want border to be set to none okay now we can go back to the browser refresh and now we can see our categories are nicely displayed without any bullets 
or anything else. Okay, in the next video, we're going to have a look at how to actually display our images whenever we click on our category.